Hi, I'm Deborah Gray Mitchell with Deborah Gray Mitchell Photography LLC in Miami, Florida. Now we're going to talk about the chemicals that you need to develop film. First, you're going to need a film developer, and there's several kinds. Uh, one of them, the ones I like is D76. Um, there are also liquid developers. There's HC110 by Kodak. There's Ilford makes developers of several kinds. But the different uh, developers do affect the film differently, so you can experiment with them. You're going to need a stop bath, which is like an indicator stop bath uh, that will stop your development. And you're going to need uh, some fixer, fixer, which comes in either regular slow fixer or rapid fixer. Once you get your film developed, then you want to wash it and you want to not waste water, so you're going to use some perma wash, which is also known as HypoClear, that will help you get your film washed quickly without, again, wasting water. And then once you get your film all washed and you want to dry it, you're going to put it in a little photo flow solution, which is a wetting agent, which keeps you from having film uh, water spots on your film. Um, that's really about it as far as the chemicals you need. Again, there are different types of developers, high contrast, soft developers, select all. Um, there's also, uh, uh, once you get your film developed, you need a way to store it. So you need glassines or some kind of uh, pages, which you can slip your negatives into. So uh, the supplies that you would need to develop film, again, are tanks and reels. You need scissors and a can opener so that you can open the ends of cans, and voila, you'll have a negative. 